a lot of excess blowing, um, excess excess mowing, and excess excess string trimming. Okay, so it took me a little bit longer. All close on care. Hello everybody, thanks for stopping by and watch. So I'm just Charles from Aqua Song Care and Fresh Washing. So this is a recurring customer. Um, she called us at the beginning of the year to service her yard. It was it was high growth <clears throat> at first. Um, I quoted her at $70 for front and back mowing, edging, and string trimming and blowing off the debris from the street, sidewalk, and driveway in, the pat in her back um, patio. So that, that's our normal full, um, full lawn care um, service, y'all. Mowing, edging, string trimming, and blowing. But um, we only serviced her yard like four times because um, she called me saying, hey, you know, I have a lawnmower. I'm going to go and take care of myself. And, you know, I was like, hey, that's great. You know, enjoy the mow. Um, don't forget to service it every week because your grass grows real fast. Because, y'all, this, this, this grass grows fast, y'all. So um, I got a call back. Uh, I got a call from her um, like five days ago. Hi, you know, this is, um, you know, so-and-so, you know, um, can you come service my yard, please? This week, like, sure, I'll be there this week. I'll let you know when I, when I, when I show up. So, so today, y'all. But her grass is high, you know what I mean? I think she waited like about three weeks, you know what I mean, to, um, to give me a call because the grass was high and you're going to see when I start to mow it. All right, so hey, um, this is um real. I'm gonna go and do some real time, real time um video right now. I ain't gonna like speed it up, y'all, cause just want to see how fast it is. If you're new to the lawn care um side hustle, or you plan on starting lawn care, or if you just want to know how to mow the grass, you know what I mean? Basic mowing right here, y'all. Basic edging, mowing, and string trimming. Okay, but um, you're gonna see right to do a couple passes with the mowing. All right. And um, so I just want to go and just relax, enjoy the enjoy the music. And if it's on, if you have it um, on a big TV, hey, sit back and relax and just enjoy. Or just um, enjoy the mo. All right, so I'm gonna go and play some music right now. So right here, I actually had the setting set like at two and three quarters, all right? And I was like, whoa, um, this is too high. So I went ahead and put it at three and a half. So this is three and a half mowing right now, y'all. And look, look how much 
we're actually shooting at the side of the chute. So um, as you can see, I'm gonna go ahead and do um, uh, two, um, one pass right now. Okay, um, right now I'm trying not to shoot all the way, all that debris on the sidewalk. So I went around, I went around. I'm just doing um, two passes shooting towards the house right now. Okay, so right here, um, now I'm, I'm going back and forth, all right? But as you can see, all of that debris is shooting to the to the sidewalk. So I'm just trying to prevent that, y'all, less blowing on the sidewalk. Okay, but when you have a lot of grass like this, it doesn't help. This is three and a half inches, y'all. I, I raised the mower deck. Okay, and that's how much grass is still coming out. So the rule is a third of the blade should be cut in mowing. All right, that's a healthy grass with sharp blades. All right, um, hey, believe it or not, y'all, your grass is alive, it's a living. Okay, so you want like a nice, fresh slice of the blades, okay? But um, this right here, y'all, is just too much. I'm just taking off too much, you know what I mean? This is like about at least an inch of the blade, maybe an inch to a, uh, Half an inch to an inch of the blade uh, of the grass coming off. All right, so I mean blade, y'all. I mean like the 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 blades, you know, the grass. That's called a blade. One little clipping is a blade. Okay, so. But um, you want to always make sure you have um, your your blades are sharpened when you have to um mow grass like this, y'all. So that way you can have like fast cuts. That way if you have dope blades, y'all. You're, you're you're working or you're you're, you're working the belt. Of the mower, you're working the engine, you're working the belt, you're working the pulleys, okay, and um, you're working the spindles. So it is real bad when you mow with um, dull blades, okay, especially when you have to mow high grass like this. So, um, hey, my recommendation, y'all, if you know you're gonna mow, mow yard like this, just take your, take your blades off and just sharpen them, all okay? right? Or buy new blades, okay? So it's bad business, y'all. When you when, bad business for your equipment when you're on uh, mowing with dull blades. All right. So here I go, y'all. So I'm gonna go ahead and do some passes. So I, there's like a lot of clumps, y'all. So what I'm what, what I want to do is just blow all that excess to one side. So that's what I'm gonna do right now. Okay. Well, not right now. Right now. All right. So I'm trying to like just cut up a lot of these um clumps. All right, it's a lot of grass, y'all. Okay, she waited. She waited. She waited. This is at least three weeks, y'all, of um, of of the grass growing. And plus, we had like a lot of rain, so that didn't help out. Okay, so just trying to break up all that, all those clumps of grass. You know what I mean? If I had um, mulching blades, I'd probably do a better job. You know what I mean? But these are just high lift blades I'm using right now. I'm using high lift blades because you got that bomb um, bahia grass. That little grass just sticks straight up this tall. And when you go over it, it just comes back up. So um, I use high lift blades and always keep my baffles on the mower. The baffles is what helps all that air, the airflow just um, shoot up and it helps the grass just shoot up. So on that, that bahia grass, y'all, which there ain't no bahia grass in this yard. Just mow real slow. Make sure you have your baffles on. Use some high lift blades and you should be able to cut that bahia grass with only one pass. All right, so right here, y'all. I think this, this is it. I'm going. You know what? I'm just going to go and start shooting it to one side. So what I could have did, y'all, was mow it at four and a half, then four inches, then three and a half, then three inches. You're probably thinking, hey, I thought you got to take a quarter off. I should be doing four and a half, four and a quarter, four, three and three quarters, three and a half. Three and a quarter, three inches, two and a quarter. And you know what, Joe? I've also do that. I would have had a charger like at least $150. Okay. So I'm trying to give her um, a good a good quote, all right, because she wants to use this again. All right. So she was a good customer the first time. I I did charge her a little bit more because the grass was high. And after that, $70. She called us, so that means a lot. So I'm just going to, it's, it's, it's a $70 quote, y'all. And it's a small front yard with this high grass, so it's not really taking that long. But here you go, blowing all the excess debris to one side. All right, y'all, so like I said, um, the mower deck right now is at three and a half. It's lifted up at three and a half inches. 
All right, doing multiple passes. Okay, multiple passes, all right. Clean it, clean it up. You know what I mean? I'm shooting off to one side. When I come back in seven days, um, I'll keep it at three and a half inches and just see, just see what happens.
my more deck was at three and a half inches y'all on this yard okay and it was um still not high enough all right so letting her service it within a week like a week later it's, it's gonna be good for our mower our equipment and her lawn so those are the type of customers that they're hoping for y'all that they know they need it serviced on weekly they want you to service it weekly okay they're reaching out to you so we're going to spend some time
also doing this yard with like a couple of passes in the front and in the back is I'm looking at my timer right now it's 37 minutes and 10 seconds okay obviously this is a short video because I edited it though but that's how long it took me out there about 37 minutes and a couple of seconds all right so, so we're just regular maintain like every week probably um cut that in half probably taking about 20 minutes to do it okay a lot of excess blowing um excess excess mowing and excess excess string trimming okay so it took me a little bit longer uh, i'm off to the next yard hey so um it looked like a mess you know what i mean when i was mowing because all that it was just freaking high i actually had it at three inches at first they had it i went up three and a half no it's two and three quarters inches like you know what i'm cutting a lot man i'm making a mess so i raised it up to three or three and a half or three and a quarter three and a half three and a quarter three and a half i think it was three and a half but he saw how much of a mess I was still making. You know what I mean? It was a high growth yard, y'all. And I was trying to... I try, I try not to make it look that messy. So as you can see in the front yard, I was going back and forth, blowing it against the house, getting all those clumps. You know what I mean? Um, just moving them to one side, okay? And I got them on the house. So I had to blow off that. It saw me blowing off the house, all that um, that debris that got stuck, that got stuck to the house. So I, I had to blow that off, okay? Hey, good customer service. Hey, never neglect blowing off the customer's back patio or porch. They're, they're, they see y'all, they see, and they take note and they remember, all right? And um, one day they may be in a bad mood and man, you know what, man, screw this yard, this long care guy, you know what I mean? You know, he does a bad job and they're gonna call somebody else. Why? Because you neglected their back porch and the extra 30 seconds are just blowing off their back porch, y'all. So don't forget that, okay? Blow off their back porch. Anyway, hey, thanks for watching. God bless. Stay hydrated. Please like and subscribe, y'all. Please like and subscribe. It'll motivate me to motivate y'all, okay? Like and subscribe. Hey, thanks for watching. See you on the next video. Bye.